Today I get to interview your boy, Big Money. What's up, y'all? It's Milana motherfucking Don. And this is Big Money, Real Street Comedy. And today we're going to do this shit a little different. For real shit, though, how many hoes you got? <laughs> real Street Comedy. Damn. Motherfucker moving. Hey, say less, man. Hey, you done took over the show today, huh? What's up, y'all? It's Milana motherfucking Don. And this Big Money Real Street Comedy. And today we're going to do this shit a little different. Mm -mm -mm. We got Real Street Comedy's finest in this bitch today. Yeah, man. What's up? What's happening, man? It's my turn to ask you all the questions. Yeah, mother go ahead, baby. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I'm speaking yeah. for the people, so... Really? I hope they ain't ask no goofy man. Fuck you. You know what? This real street comedy, man. We want to know some shit. Okay, so y'all gonna get the answers. First of all, talk to me. Cause you always asking about how much somebody pussy is. Do you buy? Have you ever bought pussy? Oh hell no. Where where the line stick? I mean the line stick. Listen, it ain't even it ain't even here because that's not even. I don't, I'm not gonna do no line. Hell no. I buy some pussy. Hell no. Hell but, no. I mean, back in my younger days. Motherfucker threw a hundred at a bitch. I ended up nailing her. But I don't know if that was considered like pain. Like, I'm, you know what I'm well, saying? No. That's what I do. It don't count if it's in the club. It don't. Yeah. Then after the club, motherfucker came to me. Boom, boom. But, you know, I put that motherfucker on her. She was like, damn. I said, yeah. I was going to make her start paying me, but she was too much. She was, she was too much coming with her. I said, you know what? Enjoy. I didn't, This is my second time about, you know, hearing you say something about a bitch paying you. You ever pimped before? Is that? Like, Most definitely. Still in effect. <laughs> I can't stand you. Hey, no, but hell yeah, though, because it's like this, you know. Uh, y'all, he not just a podcast, man. Y'all heard him. No, <laughs> so listen, right now I'm just a podcast, man, and that's just what it is. I'm, I'm, you know, I'm changed, but you know, hell yeah, you know. Uh, young ladies, they know that I'm smart. They know I look good. They know I got plenty of paper. You do look it. good. You crispy as a bitch right now. I ain't gonna lie. Thank you. You know, I mean, like, that's just what it is. That's the reason why they, <laughs> you see that? You, that's what it is, man. You know, uh. Shout out to DJ Barber again because he don't even know the type of role he play. But, yeah, he play a big role because, you know, uh, I look good already. But then with the extra little zzz, 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 zzz it's there <laughs> or automatic. But, uh, yeah, um, I'm just a podcast man right now. You know what I'm saying? They liked me. They wanted me. And they knew I knew what to do with the paper. They knew how to get in and come back with it. So, speaking of being just the podcast man. Yes, ma'am. I feel like this is something we all went on. You really having it or what? You really oh, yeah. got that skrilla? You really got some pace for what? Yeah, but then you shot this shit on my ass and talk shit now. Let's you understand. You Motherfucker come home, came home from prison, you know what I'm saying, ran it right through the roof. And then it's like, shit, I got enough. I can, You know what? I can just sit back and talk shit. I talk shit anyway, look good, and talk shit. So why not? This is this the, this, this the best platform for me, you know what I'm saying? Talk shit, look good. And I'm a real nigga, you know what I'm saying? No snitching, none of that. You know? Speaking of snitching, how you feel about that? I don't like snitches. You ain't got uh, no friends that ever ratted before? Uh, at the moment, no. I mean, I did kick it with people that did snitch. And how I that even, work? I mean, I didn't know that they were snitching and all that shit. You know I, mean? I never had a co-defendant. I never been like, oh, it's me and this and this person on the case. When I go to jail, I go to jail. But, you know, people that I hung out with, they done been snitches and rats because they hid that shit from me. You know what I'm saying? And it came out of they snitches and all that shit. You know what? Niggas enjoy, you know what I'm saying? Don't come my way. I don't let a nigga know too much anyway about big money, you know what I mean? So, they'll yeah, figure it out. But yeah, fuck them. I don't, no, we don't do that. We don't do no snitching, no telling. Jail ain't shit, man. Go there. Y'all gonna figure it out. Go there. Y'all gonna get out. Y'all gonna get out, man. Just go to jail and come back, and it's all good. Y'all wanna go to jail and then tell on somebody, and y'all still going to jail. So, <laughs> let me ask you this. Speaking of that, let me ask you this. Yeah. So... If you was ever in a situation where you was facing life for sure, but it wouldn't even your case, you wouldn't take it. Would you? Would you rat or would Listen, you take the case? Real street comedy gonna be live from the joint. It's for the, all my kids. Hell okay. no, you understand my. You know what I'm saying? You got to. I got kids that look up to me. I'm not gonna do no bogus shit 
And that's going to trail. They, they whole life going to be fucked. They're going to be like, oh, your daddy this, your daddy that. Hell no. Real your daddy no a snitching. rat. Yes, that's how yeah. I'm going. Real sure. nigga no, real nigga no snitching. Never had a co-defendant, not to mention. You know, just a boss, my nigga. Real life, my nigga. Take your hit, and you're going to get out. Trust me. You're going to get out of jail. Okay. That's free game. Yeah. Nobody talk, everybody walk, man. Trust me. It's going to work out for you. It's easier said than done, though. <laughs> hey, yeah. look, I know the niggas like, uh-uh. Anyways, yeah. okay, so another thing that the ladies wanted me to ask you is explain yourself, because there's a lot of people that's mad at you for that Monday shit. A lot of people, you be, you be. Oh, I, no, the Monday, listen here, the Monday, listen here, the Monday go like this. <laughs> Everything that I post on Monday, it already hit the internet. I don't do videos that people send me from close friends. I don't do that because that's close friend, that's private. Right, so right, I don't right. even do that. But if a video was posted on, on Instagram or Facebook, whatever, somebody sent it to me, oh, we're going to figure it out on Monday. We're going to see y'all. And I don't do nothing. I ain't, I ain't like nobody sneaking no video at nobody. Motherfuckers just send me the video. I put the song on it on beat though. Catch them on you, beat You definitely though. get their ass on beat. And whatever, and however they looking and feeling right there, I put the caption on there. You know, and everybody just listen, the crowd go wild. That's just so, what it is. With that being said, to sum it all up, do you do it with no regards of humiliating humiliating them, it's or just, just genuinely having it's, it's, fun it's, 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 and joking around? Genuinely having fun. So, man, no matter, I y'all heard him. I didn't put my friends on there, my brothers on you put there, me on there, everybody. Bitch. Y'all put you on there. Everybody done been on there. You know, it's all fun. I got to put myself on there. Like, it ain't, so what? 24 hours, man, y'all going to be famous, and then y'all enjoy your life. Like, like, I don't tag nobody for the simple fact that ain't nobody finna get no free promotion off me. Or if I put you on there and you don't really want to see everybody see you dancing, you know what I'm saying? They ain't not going to even be able to go to your page. And like, they don't right. even know who you. That's why I just post it. I don't put no names on there. Okay. You know what I mean? So y'all like, heard like, him. He just joking. Y'all yeah. can't be mad. Y'all can't be mad. Y'all going to be all right. 24 hours. We definitely ought to been on there. This bitch put me on there. Yeah, man. I put everybody on there, man. I with it. Okay, so another thing. <sighs> so a lot of people feel like you put women down. Like, th- that's the thing that you do. Like, you want to clear that up or what you got to say about that? A lot of f- people feel like you be putting uh, women down. You be bashing women a lot. No, I never bash no women. I don't bash women at all. Like, I never bash nobody. It's just that uh, bitches can't get close to me because, you know what I'm saying, I done had... A lot of bitches. A lot of them. So it's like this. I know what they be on. I'm not no dummy. You know what I'm saying? I mean, I didn't see, I didn't see, I didn't experience. You know what I'm saying? I didn't learn from other people. I didn't see well, niggas. Well, no, not not in that way. I think they talk like, I've heard people say like, off of watching the interviews like that you've done with us, like how you be saying, bitch. I know we be joking because we cool. Yeah. But a lot of people feel like you don't got respect for women off of what no. they seen through the listen, podcast. Listen, everybody wouldn't come on this show if it was like that. Everybody love me. Everybody fuck with me. You know what I'm saying? It's all funs and giggles. Don't nobody care. It's a, it's a word, bitch. It's a it's just a word. Like, like what the fuck? It's just a word. It ain't a bad thing. But you know what I'm saying? It's like, that's the type of relationship me and the people have when we get loose and we have fun. We talk shit. It's real street comedy. This ain't no, you know what I'm saying? Damn, hold on. There we go. There my we fuck, go. My fuck up. <laughs> Yeah, this is real street comedy. I had she came and set up and did everything herself. You know what I mean? She don't know I'm no better. Drunk. <laughs> yeah, but like I said, this is real street comedy. You know what I'm saying? We gonna keep this shit street. We gonna have fun and we gonna laugh. You know what I'm saying? But most part, we gonna keep it real and we gonna laugh. You know what I'm saying? Trust me, y'all. But um, yeah, though I uh, I love women. Matter of fact, I love women. All the women love me. Everybody love me. I look good, smell good, got paper, make their ass laugh, and we gonna have a great time. Like we always gonna have a great time. Always gonna have a great time. You know Back what to what you said, bitches can't get close to you. Yeah, because like this, okay. You ain't got no girl. You ain't got no not one. Listen, we ain't talking about special. this. This is real street comedy. We're not gonna talk about that. Right? No, we. Listen, I'm real street comedy. Listen here, I'm the boss. I got the money and the dick. Oh my god. So she gonna figure it out. Yeah, the pussy they ain't run the world. Listen, up. no, this dick. This in here, they need this. They need this. Trust and believe me. This long bone I got. This is here. <laughs> you see this microphone? It's about three of them. All right, you will see after the show. You de- let me see that, dude. <laughs> he about to show. He, yeah. Uh, we finna put it. that on Monday. Hey, yeah. Uh, but look though, <laughs> it's like this. I done seen women. I seen they niggas go to jail and they out here fucking off. I didn't fuck niggas, bitches that with, that, that, that's in the joint. You feel me? Then you know what I'm saying people niggas pass away. They bitch out here fucking like hell. No money. I'm not gonna be out here. You passed down. away. Yeah, but I'm saying I'm not gonna be out here winding down to no bitch. 
And then when I'm gone, you write on the next nigga. That love ain't real, my nigga. You feel me? You can't necessarily say that. That bitch that better be a like, widow. What about, better be a widow. What about, I mean, that, I feel like that don't hold no way. What about bitches that held niggas down and ain't work? It, it go, it's different <laughs> situations. Right. Come right. on now. You're right. You're right, but it's still like me. Y'all yeah. seen everybody that came on this motherfucker already. Everybody that came on my motherfucker show. And they still living. Ain't nothing got, ain't nothing happening. Nothing motherfuckers came on my show with thousands. Damn. They know I got paper. Come on, run that shit through the money counter. Have fun. Do y'all. So what? You know what I mean? We on the show. Y'all lead comfortably. Y'all, when y'all in big money hands, y'all good. Yeah. You would say more. Uh, yes, I do. Oh, my God. And I don't, reasons, brag, I don't even brag on it. The streets know. The streets know like all oh, big money. Oh, yeah. He know how to fight. So, yeah. You must bob it or weaving. That's crazy. You look like you be knocking shit over. Hell, yeah. It's just that shit, you know. See, you know, I was blessed. You know, people be blessed, like, learn how to play. They know how to play basketball. <laughs> they know how to rap, all that. I know how to fucking fight. <laughs> I know how to fucking fight, swear to God. Bro, what? And oh, my G's, God. You, know, you can't I'm make doing. this shit up. This oh, my God. Listen, like I said, it's real street, and y'all get y'all ass beat. And y'all get y'all ass beat. Swear to God, hell Damn. yeah. Damn, where you grow up at? Man, I grew up on the east side of Milwaukee, like... That shit changed my whole life. Like seeing everything, being down there, having yeah. fun, gambling. Yeah. Then getting money. You ever worked a real job? Like Yep, I worked one. Me and my man's uh me and my man's KB, man. We had a um we had our first job. And he got the job first. He called me like, he like big money. I just got a job. Go up there. I'm like, go up there. He like, just go up there and say you had an interview. So I said, what? He said, yeah, man, you got to dress nice. I said, oh, he said, man, you got to have my jacket. So I said, I got to have your jacket. He like, yeah, man, where the heck good jacket? So I'm like, cool. Toast, man. Real street comedy. Real street comedy. Black-owned businesses, you know. Mm-hmm. Mm. What are you black-owned, man? This shit going to go far, man. It's starting right now. You know, we got to start somewhere. Mark my words, y'all. This show going to the roof. I honestly believe that. They're going to be like, damn, I should have got on. Be like, nope. <laughs> nope. Back then, they ain't want me. Now I'm hot. They all know me. Yeah, I mean, I'm hot now. You been but hot. They just dumb, though. People just be so dumb and scared. They be, people scared to come on my show because uh, I keep that shit real. I'm going to let they ass know the truth. Uh, and I'm going to ask all the questions. I'm going to ask about all the rumors. Like, so what? Yeah. I know how to fight, too, anyway. So I motherfucker come up. <laughs> motherfucker talking shit. They come on real shit. Come get their ass beat. <laughs> And leave like they like like motherfucker come I right, bring a motherfucker on the show beat their ass on the show and make their ass leave on the like, show. Oh my kids, that shit yes. happened before. No, that's what I'm talking. About. I will do that. That's oh my god, that, I don't care. Yeah. Niggas, and these niggas hoes yeah, out here, man. Nobody, honestly, these like everybody be having beef with somebody. <laughs> well, we stay in the same city, right? If y'all on tour with a nigga, he go out all the time. It's what the fuck is it so hard to catch exactly, a motherfucker? Right, yeah, type shit. You know shit. what I'm saying? Like, yeah. come on now, get your type lame shit. ass out. There don't be no real drama, man. Type that shit. shit be for the birds, man. So you not that, beefing with nobody? No, I don't do that. Yeah. I nip shit in the bud or just knock a motherfucker out. They just, I, I walk, I'm the type of nigga to walk right in the club, knock yeah. you out and just be like, what? <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's time to go now, y'all. <laughs> that, that's what I do. Oh, shit. Been doing that. Or, or in jail, knock a motherfucker out. How many times you been to jail? How many times I've been in jail, like mm. booked in the jail? Oh man. You been in and out of jail your whole life. Man, <laughs> damn near <laughs> hell yeah. Four months here, three months here, nine months here, a year here, a year here, a year and a half. What was your biggest imp- inspiration um to do this show? Man, I told you like like DC. DC Young, that's oh, my wow. nigga. And my kids, I swear to God, like doing my niggas. I see they shit. <laughs> I study they shit. Oh, and wow. um, Funny Marco. Mm-hmm. Funny Marco. Funny Marco. That's oh, one of your life. favorites, too? Yes. Funny Marco. Having an influence, a bigger influence on our city now. What what advice do you got for these kids? Because it's, you, you you see how this shit going. Man, I, stay in school. For the kids. Stay in school, kids. If y'all don't stay in school, just listen. All you got to do is listen and pay attention. Just go, just graduate from high school. I ain't finna tell y'all to go to college and all that shit. Y'all go to high school and figure it out. Y'all listen here. Just as long as y'all stay in school, y'all gonna know all the street knowledge, all the book knowledge y'all need to know. You know what I'm saying? Y'all gonna learn life lesson skills. You know what I'm saying? Y'all gonna be able to live forever. Don't do no dumb shit. Don't trick yourself off. Don't do that. Don't trick yourself off. Do good. Be good. You know what I'm saying? Y'all ain't gotta do, y'all ain't gotta be excellent. Ain't no perfect motherfucker. But listen here. Do enough for your mama don't say shit to you, daddy don't say shit to you, or the teachers don't say shit to you. The rest of that, y'all can slip through the cracks and do what y'all want to do, man. That's just real shit, man. Okay. And I should have asked this question first, but what, what, 
what made you want to be a podcast man? Like, where was this idea coming from? Oh, um, making the videos on Monday came after that. But no, I just make videos every day, every morning. You know what I'm saying? You know, I'm a full time dad, like a, a hundred million percent time dad. So, you know, I'm taking the kids to school every morning. I'm picking the kids up from school. I'm up. I'm wild woke already. Geek. They didn't. They didn't talk. Daddy, daddy, daddy. So now I was like, you know what? Now I'm gotta drop their ass off at school. I'm on Instagram in the morning talking shit. So now everybody waking up to me. So they like, why he waking up? Now knowing I'm really taking. The, I got a responsibility. I'm taking the kids to school. So that's why I'm up every morning making 15 second videos. So everybody like, they laughing. They go. Everybody going crazy. Everything going viral on there. This and that. So now they're like, oh, we want to get a show. Get a show. So I'm like, how the fuck I'm gonna get a show? What the fuck is a show? So I'm like, I looked that shit up. Like. All I had to do is buy this and buy that, buy that. I said, oh, that shit ain't, I got the paper. That shit ain't nothing. Let's get it. Bing, bing, bing. And then New Year's, when January 1st came, I told him. I started 2022 out uh, with my show, man. And it's, you know, it's been working out for me. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Once the motherfucker got the paper and all that, I ain't got to be out here answering no phone. Hello. You know, I'm 30 years old. Fuck, like, hello, hello, hello. I'm a, you know what I'm saying? I done did that shit my whole motherfucking life, my nigga. It's a time for a change, man. I don't want to be doing that shit till I'm, 40 and 50, hell no, my nigga. If it ain't worked out for you right now, y'all need to stop. Right. Real simple. Y'all just dumb. Just look, just think about it. Y'all really answering the phone, trying to make some motherfucking money, and y'all been doing this shit for how long? Ooh, you finna make a lot y'all of Y'all better stop. Man, I don't give gosh. a fuck. Listen here, listen here, that ain't it. Y'all gotta Ooh. find y'all lane. Like me, I find my lane, and I look. I got the best show in the city, man. Big money. Nothing. You, you, you can fight, right? I done whooped everybody. I done heard about you whooping some ass. I whooped everybody. Yes, I can. Because I was like, you finna make a lot of motherfuckers mad. With they, 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 beat they, they come on the show, beat their ass. They come on the show, get their ass whooped. That's that. <laughs> Real Street County. Mac, 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 Slam, all got the bed, what? On the table. Mac, all that. They know. In jail, out of jail, everywhere. Whoop I shit. I definitely done heard about you whooping shit. I ain't yeah, gonna lie. I'll be beating shit up, man. But I, I, that's the past. I'll be just trying to, I'm just a podcast. He's a man. changed man now, y'all. I'll be just trying to chill, man, and give money. It look nice, you know what I mean? They hoes come to me. I just be like, they be you funny. Like, this here. It's the haircut, y'all. Yeah, it's the haircut. It's the, definitely the haircut. So. And the diamonds, too. Probably the diamonds. But the haircut, come on. <laughs> so, with this way, where you see yourself? Where you taking this? To what, the roof, what, man. What is it that you see? <coughs> Bigger than a breakfast club. What can we expect? Are they big? So they yeah, I'm trying to be with them. I know that's right. I mean, I look up to them. With Million Dollar Game, too. Look up to them, too. I look up to everybody, so, man. Funny Marco, all of them. I love them. I look oh, yeah, up to true. them. Like, like hell yeah, I want to be like, I deserve that shit, you know what I'm saying, from a, a real nigga that really was in the streets, really selling dope, you know what I'm saying, real life, jumped off the porch when I was motherfucking 12 years old, I see the bitch having money, you know what I'm saying, I was raised good though, my mama and my dad raised me good, my mama, I was supposed to have been in fucking university, college, a lawyer, some shit like that, how she raised me, but it was me, I fucked up. Because I just let that money blind me. Shit happened. Yeah, shit happened. But hell yeah, though, man. I see myself going to the roof. Man. I should have been dead. I would have been to the top. But, you know, it's going to work. Trust me, because I'm I, I'm dedicated to this shit. And, I'm hey, listen, y'all, I ain't going to let nobody down from the city, man. I ain't going to let nobody. I ain't going to let myself down. Y'all going to figure it out. So, on a business tip, I want the kids to hear this. Is it ever? Has it ever been time since you started doing this that you got discouraged? Like, maybe your views wasn't popping or? Oh, no, no, no. Oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> so, what would you tell somebody that's starting up some shit like this? Like, what would be your advice to them? Um, my advice to them who started this shit, uh, don't even try. I got the shit in the head. Like, <laughs> it's over. Don't try it. No, but I'm saying like, okay. Listen, maybe listen. But if y'all got a show, a podcast, just stop it. It's not gonna work out for Jeez, you. Big money that came over and took over everything. Y'all so weak. That shit lame. Get y'all big. Y'all gotta go to church or some shit. Find something else to do. Oh my life. Cause now, if y'all keep doing it, I might get to knocking motherfuckers out. Swear to God. What? Hell so, yeah. So if you got a podcast. Or a show. Or a show. Anything. In that or a radio show, station. I'm beating the fuck out you. He beating that ass. Y'all better just. He it, want listen, all the smoke. I'm giving y'all like two, three months just to quit. If y'all do this in two, three months, oh my, y'all better be doing push ups, know how to find. I'm gonna beat y'all ass. And that's gonna be that. You this real it. street comedy. I got the city on fucking lock. <laughs> Not, not. Yes, I do got the city on lock. Hell yeah. Nah, he be somebody getting their ass whooped. Hell, on my, on my, yes. They gonna figure it so, out. So, so y'all be expecting further down the lines videos on Facebook and no, Instagram. No, ain't gonna do that. No, <laughs> <laughs> no I'll be just saying that. No, I'm just saying all all those up. They can go ahead and do them. It's not gonna work out for them because they're not. It, it's only one big money. This is what it is. It's only one big money. Y'all can't beat me. 
Or y'all can't see me on no level. You know what I'm Y'all don't look better than me. Y'all got more money than me. So I heard you move. Where you at now? Oh, yeah, secret location. <laughs> On probation, secret location. Oh, you better. I know that's right. As low as a bitch, you know what I mean? But yeah, man. But is it somewhere bigger and better? They got better opportunities? Yes, yeah, got better opportunities. I mean, listen, though, but man, what you got opportunities? This is where I started at. This is where I'm from. Right, this is right, where right. I live at, you know what I mean? 3278, man. This is where motherfucker then. This is where I came up at. So I can never forget y'all. That's why. I, Got everybody the opportunity to come on the show. Come on the show. Y'all don't want to come on the show. That's on you. When y'all see motherfucker with sitting next and bump, bump and shoulders, all the celebrities and everybody who y'all really wanted to meet, do not contact me. Because listen here, it's not going to happen. Because I know a quick word for that, guys. Um, and it's uh, no. <laughs> <laughs> simple. I knew you were going to say some bullshit. I'm looking at no, it's I'm real simple. Now. Like, no. Hell no. You know what I'm saying? Because I gave y'all the opportunity to come on the show. Y'all better get that 300 ready and your attitude <laughs> yeah. come correct. No, they fucked up. Cause don't, they really mad at me. That's why they ain't supporting me. Don't when this wave go up, when this shit take off. That's why they ain't supporting me. Because they mad at me. They ain't supporting me because they mad at me. And they fucked up. Well, listen here, though. They going to figure it out, though. They going to be still at the bottom. I'm going to be at the top. And then that's just what it is, man. Well... That concludes all my questions. Is there anything else? You want to pop some shit right now? No, quick? I just want you to check that out. That ass is fat. All right, y'all. Well, I love being on this fucking show. This is real street comedy. Thank you for having me on this motherfucker. Oh, yeah, most definitely. Hey, but you said earlier, uh, yeah, you got to shake that ass for us real quick. I'm going to shake this motherfucker. Real street comedy. We out this bitch. Then. <laughs> All the big asses report to Real Street Comedy right now. Right now. <laughs>